they just said uh, that he, he spoke to you and said uh, it was time you know, for luck to turn your guys' way. He didn't think do that. What's your guys' reaction um, now getting in? Uh, we just going to go out and continue doing what we're doing and um, take our anger out from the uh, last game to this game. You still got anger from that game? Uh, yeah, I, <laughs> <laughs> dream about this shot every night. I can't even, it's just still in my head. <laughs> uh, uh, right now, I'm feeling just excited to be in, you know, uh, after losing that game, of course, the way we did, but I just think it's like a, a fresh start for us and we get to go and make some things happen. Brad, you came here to play in the NCAA tournament. What's that feeling when you see your name go up? Uh, it's just a sign of relief, you know, that we can keep the tradition going uh, for, I think it's six now, back to back. And it's my second year here, so I'll be able to say I went two years that I came here and I just want to go and win, like go deep, deep as we can. After you lost that game the other night, well, everybody said you lost that game. That's how big a scratch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I agree with that. Did you guys have any doubt that you might not get in? Uh, at first, we thought we was gonna um, be playing in the playing game. That's what we were, well, that's what um, coach was saying at first that we should just get ready to play in the playing game. And at what point did you did your mind at ease that you probably wouldn't be in the playing game? Uh, well, yeah, when well, we finally saw it today. So you came in today thinking you had a good chance of being in the play in Yeah. Both of you? Yeah. How's your knee? I'm good, you know. At this point, I think everyone is pretty banked up. But, I mean, I can play. That's all that matters. I'm going to get out there and play and do whatever I can, you know, to help us win. You know, if you would actually get an extra day, you're going to play some Friday. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> I think the time will help us all. It will. <laughs> Bad bruise from the fall. Bad bruise from the fall. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, uh, that's my butt. But I'm good. <laughs> I'm dealing with that. You know, I had to rub that off. Uh, how, how do you think you guys are playing going into the tournament? Your quality of play. You think you're playing well, or you think you're peaking because you played all year? What do you, you think? You talking about going into this tournament or the uh, this conference? One. Tournament? I don't care about the other one. This one. Uh, I think um, we, we, um, everybody's mindset is where it should be. Like. We know what it takes. Like out of all the losses, we know exactly what it takes to win. Especially like last game, we know exactly what it takes. We can't never stop until the red light on the back of the backboard goes. So we just gotta stay together like we did the whole game and just continue that throughout this tournament. Does last year's experience help? Yes, because um, last year our first game we was down and we came back from you know quite a deficit late in the game. But uh, like he said, everyone's matured more mindset-wise, so I think we'll be good. Did you guys have anything, I don't know if there's anything to prove, but you had a lot of high expectations coming in. You've reached your, your main goal, but how do you see what's a great finish for you guys here? Uh, I don't want to put like a cap on it, but you know, just going, just getting some wins in the tournament and then seeing what happens. And I think that'll take care of all the things that we were supposed to do up to this point, just winning the tournament. What do you feel about that? Just the season in general, you guys kind of had to battle your way through it a lot with some uh, injuries. You're kind of on the fringe of the top 25, not really you know, mm -hmm. in the national conversation, but yet here you are again. What do you guys think you have? Uh, we just going to have to put all that past us and just take one game at a time. Like, now is step up your play even more. Like, like me and Gary, Farad, like all the seniors, well Gary not a senior, but all the seniors, we're gonna have to step up even more if we really want, if like, if we really want this for ourselves and for the team. You have to feel good um, the way Troy's played the last two games. What do you guys think of what he's done the last couple of games? Oh, it's been good. He had, what, 37 last game, I'm on 40. <laughs> Does that give you any more confidence that, that he's uh, yeah, I mean, he's the he, well, he's the leader of the team. Well, like the vocal of the team. So when we see him playing good, we just feed off him and stuff like that. Have you guys heard anything about St. Joseph? You know anything about them? There's a lot of teams in the country. What do you know about? 
I don't know much about him personally. But um, well, I heard like a little talk in the locker room saying that they got a couple. Um, they got two guys that can really play, like put the ball in the hoop. So I guess they're gonna be our main focus. Well, we already gonna play good defense, but that's the, that's the only thing what I heard about them. Just going through a game like that, four overtimes, seemed like somebody was getting hurt. Every turn, Gary's limping, Shaq gets hurt. Does that bring you guys together more? The way that you were able to keep fighting, you come back from seven down, you keep pushing it into more and more overtimes. Does that bring you guys together more? Yeah, because we want to win the game for them and for ourselves too. Like we see all our players going down. We just got to keep staying together, keep staying together. We can't let that fold, make us fold. We just got to stay strong and keep continue playing with toughness. Did it look like Gary couldn't walk up the floor to you guys half of the night? Or on TV, it looked like he was, he didn't bounce the ball and then was kind of struggling. I mean, I know, I mean, he, he had a hurt ankle, so before the game, he was limping, but he played with a lot of toughness. He came out and did his thing with, with one ankle. Hard to turn on a TV without seeing that shot replay. When you yeah. see it, do you watch it? Do you turn it off? Do you look to uh, avoid the TV? What do you do? I've seen it a couple of times, but I usually turn the TV or close my eyes and walk out of the room <laughs> or something like that. I don't like seeing it. Yeah, I hate seeing it. I don't think it was supposed to count personally. Yeah, but. everybody act like it just was supposed to count when like it didn't supposed to count. Right. But he still made the shot. It's a hell does, of it make, game. does it make it worse the fact that they won today? Uh, I knew that um, it was gonna have to. We we were the only we we were the um better two teams in the conference. Well, as you can see, because after our game, they beat everybody by double digits and blew everybody out. So we knew going into that game it was gonna be a comeback game. So you figured whoever won that game was gonna win the tournament. Yeah, basically. Yep. Yeah. Maybe I'm not sure how much you go back and listen to quotes or read quotes or listen to post game pressers from your head coach. You spent time doing that, but he, he's done a lot in fighting for this team. Uh, the last couple of weeks, really at the podium, he said a lot to defend this team. Mm -hmm. um, did you guys get that sense from from coach that he was trying to, to defend your right to make the NCAA tournament? Yeah, he know that um, this is what all of us want, and we know that he gonna fight with us no matter what because he always tell us that like. He gonna fight for us no matter what. So, for I can tell you. <laughs> Octavius, you made a reference to uh, we learned a lesson. You gotta go until the thunder sounds or red light flashes or whatever. I don't remember exactly how you phrased it, but did you feel like you guys celebrated a little bit too soon? Yep, too early. Well, actually, I it was me. I was so happy. Kale hit the shot. I ran, hugged Kale. I turned around and shot in the air. <laughs> 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 was it one of those slow motion things? Yeah, like. <laughs> so it's a golden shot. I was like, that's, 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 that's yeah. a good one. No wonder you keep reading with that. <laughs> I'm Look, watching that one. How long did you think it was in the air? It was in the air about five seconds. It was just in the shot. slow it motion, like. It's good. But it still went in before the buzzer sound. Yeah. That's what's crazy. It went in and then it But it was in. 0.8 seconds, so I'm running down the court hugging kid. Yeah. Crazy. Do you feel Basketball. like you have rivalry with Rutgers and Purdue? Yeah, I think we I think it, I, we got to have some good luck coming out. We had too much bad luck this year. Well, not bad luck, but not luck coming our way. Like, I, for instance, I can say the Butler game was another um, situation like that where we got too comfortable at the end of the game and they heaved it up the court, blew pass, and laid it in for a game. Do you feel that playing against another team that likes to bag you low in the post is better or worse for you? Uh, I don't know. I, actually, I'm a physical player, so I like the physical, physical play. So it really doesn't matter to me. <laughs> I just hope. When I play physical, the, the referees don't look at me like I'm the bad person when they playing just as physical as me. Like, so that's the only thing I got to watch out for. For a you had to sit out a couple weeks because of the knee, and you weren't even able to practice. Mick said you couldn't even, you weren't even allowed to take jump shots. Uh, how much better do you feel after getting these last two games in and then being able to work back into 
sure getting into basketball straight? Uh, I feel good, you know, going out there. And coming from that, because uh, the way how my knee was feeling, I didn't know how fast I would be able to come back. And uh, But I feel fine right now. It, it still get a little sore when I'm playing, but it's nothing I can do about it, so I just got to play through it.